Uh, Tyrell, let's maybe just go back to the week and uh, the week that was, and you guys had that. You know, didn't pick up any points against Abbotsford. Anything that you liked about the game, though, that you guys were able to bring into this up upcoming weekend against Chicago? Yeah, f for the most part, we played hard. Um, we weren't always consistent at times. It wasn't our best weekend, obviously, but uh, we know what time of year is coming. We, we want to play with urgency. We want to play uh, with a little bit of a desperate mindset here. So. Uh, that's what we're going to do, try to move it into this weekend. One of the things that the guys have talked about is playing with desperation. You guys did that when you know you had that 11-game slide where you went 0-10-1, and, and then you're like, well, it's playoffs the chance. You played with desperation. You guys, you know, 9-1-0, and forced yourself back into the conversation. You built a big cushion. But that's one of the things they said is, you know, you played with desperation. Is that hard to do, though? Is it hard to do for, you know, 20, 30 games to play that level of – keep maintaining that level of desperation to get into the playoffs? Yeah, that's a good question. Um – I think it just becomes part of you. Like, we we did go on that slide, and then we did work really hard to get to this point where we're at. But we're not willing to let that slide. So we're going to play as hard as we need to play every night. And that being said, it's, it's playoff time. So every game's a playoff game, and then we're going to roll into playoffs, and then every game's do or die. You know, that's what, it, that's what it comes down to. So it's that time of year where desperation's needed, and it just becomes your new normal. I guess conversely, you know, and kind of – piggybacking off what you just said isn't that a, I guess it you could look at it as a positive in the sense that if you've been playing that high level of play you don't have to kind of ramp it up you've already kind of continue it into the playoffs yeah that's the goal um the, the league itself ramps up right like it, it gets better and each team gets better individuals get better like it's it's how it works and going into playoff time every team is looking to find the next level of their game they're trying to they're trying to play harder. They're trying to play more, you know, physical or faster or whatever that team's identity is. That's what they're trying to do. So that's what we're doing. We're going to match that going into playoffs. And, yeah, you don't have to build anything because you're already rocking at that level. You guys have a, a cushion on the Wolves here, your first uh, series here, this four-game homestand, and then, of course, Iowa. So kind of works out the two teams that are ch chasing you are the two teams you're facing. Uh, what do you guys have to do in terms of readiness and, and is, again, is it cliche is just focus on the one game and not worry about the playoffs and anything else? Yeah, this is a, as big as it gets for us this year, these four games coming up. We, we know what the standings look like. We're aware of it. Um, there's not much that changes. We, we got to play hard. We got to play, again, I'm going to double down on that desperation mentality because, you know, these are massive points coming up and we're not willing to let those slide.